Hey, Jay, how'd that start? Well, I don't know. He ran right square my goddamn left foot. What are you talking about? Stupid? Oh, Lord, A.J. Floyd blames it on Kevin Colton. Well, goddamn Jeff Andretti ran right over. He's all over the goddamn track. Vintage A.J. A.J., it was Jeff Andretti that got... Well, yeah, he's all over the goddamn track. You don't know where in the hell he's going. And it was suspension problem that... Yeah, I mean, kept then. from knocking him through the goddamn wall. I'm tired of this shit. Got people out there that shouldn't even be in the goddamn race car. Well, you talk about emotion. There's the vintage A.J. Foyt. You don't do that shit to me or to anybody on the front straightaway like that. Uh, never. 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 Never Don't let him get the point across. Uh, get the point this is old race. You go around like that, yeah. and you kill somebody. God damn it! You don't do it. Come on, Al. Come on. We moved over everybody on, on the front. Just calm down. We don't, we don't need this shit. We don't need this shit. Hey, just calm down. Everything's fine. Last couple of laps. Bozell and me. You don't do that at 200, Roger. Original Spider-Man, the one that got it done. Ooh, she's cussing. What is wrong? How is he going to explain his way out of this? Two fuck? Canadian nationals. What the fuck? What the fuck? Brother, you fucking destroyed my car. I have no cars. I have no fucking cars now. I have no cars now. Wow. Confrontation behind the wall. And Tracy had no answer. He had no answer for Tagliani's questions. Tag was smart. He kept his helmet on. Champ car officials on pit road. Okay. Fisticuffs break out behind the wall. Bourdais is stopping his second stop of the day. What the fuck? You fucking destroy my car. I have no cars. I have no fucking cars left. I have no cars left. Elio emotional like this and angry. That was Kevin Blanche that he was having words with. Sebastian Bourdais. Sebastian Bourdais. Bourdais. Bourdais is very angry. He's motioning to Andretti in the car right now. Very upset. Uh, we very were, upset. We were just talking about it, guys. I mean, this pit lane is always throwing a lot of guys in for a curve. Yeah, it's probably my fault. I should have said something. I had no fucking idea. Bordet climbing out of his car. It's obviously over for both of those drivers, and we apologize for the language. He was at 47 points the way it was, and now it's 57 points based on where he is right now. He'll have to make the mandatory trip to the infield care center. And I think, Whoa. And I think we'll apologize and for actually, the gesture. Yes, and uh, that is a fine, and probably a fine times too, actually, since he was coordinated enough to do it with both hands. <laughs> like Sato had a four second lead just pulled away kind of got held up by Marco Andretti and then you get beat out of the pits and that really gets him in the, in the middle of this whole thing well when you're down pits where we are you're going to get beat out we had a great stop but the deal with Marco and all that more or less I would have to say blocking for his own damn car is a bunch of crap uh they don't seem like they want to do anything there and like this deal here was probably a just as much his on trying to move over as the other boy but what gets you a car lap down you'd think you'd back off but I don't know. You got a bunch of goddamn idiots, is all I can say. Well, 
I would say that the, 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 Larry. This puts Dixon right back in play again. And what Jan was just yeah, talking about. The danger zone for Simon Pagano and Elio Castroneves. They have not pitted. Over and they touched wheels, so that so could be an avoidable contact. He's mad. I'd be mad too. Let me go. Quite often in the NTT IndyCar Series, Oriol Serbia oh! drives the pace car. He almost Look drives it. him into the wall. Rossi has got his hand out of the cockpit. He is furious. Oh, that was crazy.